Tonight on our new NHL team coming here to Las Vegas. And now that we know we are getting a pro hockey team, someone has to go out there and fill the roster. And that someone was named today. 13 Action News reporter Marty Glazer is at the new T-Mobile Arena where the team's first major hire was announced. It's the first major step in a long process. Today, the team's owner, Bill Foley, named George McPhee as the general manager of the NHL's yet-to-be-named expansion team. I was looking for a guy that was going to be as dedicated, focused, take no prisoner attitude. George McPhee comes to Vegas after spending 17 years as a general manager of the Washington Capitals. He's hoping to pick up in Vegas where he left off in Washington as a leader of a winning team. His goal? To bring the Stanley Cup to Las Vegas, a place he's excited to call home. It's out in Summerlin and that's, that's where we're going to look for homes. My wife, I have th three kids, uh, two of them in college, but we have a young one, and uh, I promised her a pool, so, so we'll be looking next week. McPhee says most likely you won't catch him in his swim trunk since his days will be spent at the office. He's tasked with building the new team from scratch and making it competitive in the world's best hockey league. The NHL is the first of the four major sports, football, basketball, baseball, and hockey, to place a team in Las Vegas. But they may not be the last. This move could pave the way for one of the other leagues, likely the NFL, possibly the Raiders, to follow suit. Foley says now that he's named the team's general manager, his next plan of action, which has been rather complicated, is coming up with the team's name. Now he wants that name to represent Vegas while also screaming out tough and competitive. Reporting from the T-Mobile Arena, Marty Glazer, 13 Action News. Governor Brian Sanders.